The OECD G20 BEPS project has developed plans to stop treaty shopping, which occurs when companies seek to take advantage of tax treaties between two contracting states using a shell company based in a third jurisdiction. A classic example would see Company A, resident in, say, the Cayman Islands, licensing its intellectual property to Company C, based in, for instance, South Africa via a letterbox company based in a European country with a treaty network allowing for treaty shopping. In this example, there's no tax treaty in place between the Cayman Islands and South Africa. But the European country does have a tax convention with South Africa under which no withholding tax is applied on royalties. Since the European country's domestic law does not call for withholding tax on outbound payments, royalties for the group are not taxable in either companies A, B, or C. What's the solution? The BEPS project will require countries to adopt, at a minimum, rules designed to ensure that only true residents qualify for treaty benefits. These include various combinations of limitation on benefits rules, which are a specific type of anti-treaty abuse rule, and more general principal purpose test rules. This will allow South Africa, in this example, to apply its domestic rate of withholding. Tax treaties will specifically state that their objective is preventing double taxation and not facilitating treaty shopping. <laughs>